hey 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 welcome back to my channel i know it's been a while I've been busy 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 i'm just chiming in to say thank you for everybody who is already subscribing been liking and posting and um <clears throat> um giving feedback on all of the content is just very been really really helpful if you have not subscribed please do so um like the content and and because it definitely does help us with all the youtube um algorithms and sit back relax and hopefully we'll be continue to bring you some enjoyable content See you soon. So, hey, everybody. I just wanted to give an update on some things. So, it's been a while since I've done a video. But, as you can see, you know, we lost one to heat. And so, with the help of my brother and my husband and um, my mom and my dad and some other people in our family, we were able to build the ducks in extension which we built them an extension of a pond to their oasis. So now they can go in from over here and we, they can go in over here and then they can go into the little pool here so that when it's hot, then they can get in the water. And it's cool because we were, this is a rubber tub. So we bought this rubber tub from the tractor supply. So it was a 110 gallon rubber tub from the water, from the tractor supply that I, were, I was able to buy. And, um, I actually got this idea off of Pinterest of how to make it work. And so um, <clears throat> basically what they did was is that they bought the tub from Pinterest, I mean, from Tractor Supply. And then um, we actually were, were able to buy one thing, one that had a spout on it. So when we're ready to release the water, it's a spout here that we can attach the water hose and we can let the water run down into our wood woodland area back here and it can run down into the woods. And then we can get rid of the water that way, put in new water this way. Um, but what I'm thinking about trying to do is get a fresh water pump and figure out how to connect that up. But in the interim, I bought all these stones from Lowe's. So this was kind of an expensive project. But the reason why I was willing to invest was because I felt like this was something that I, we were going to do to maintain for a long time. And this was something that we were really adamant about. And so that we realized that the ducks really wanted a lot of access to water. And so we felt like this was something that we could do long term. And so we took us about maybe 20 things of gravel. This is about, this is about 60 stones. And um, then we put some pea rocks on top so they don't cut their feet. And then, of course, we attached to the run with the tarps. Um, so it's like a little makeshift pond. And they seem to really like it. It's cool over here. Like, it's covered. So even during the heat of the day, like, even when it's hottest, which is right, kind of right now, because you can see the sun is reflecting off of me, then it's, like, still cool to them. And that water is really cold, actually. And what we've also been doing was another idea that I found from another um, YouTube channel. I don't even know the young lady's name, but I can't take credit for it. And what we've been doing lately is we've been taking old like Coke bottles or Gatorade bottles and we've been freezing the water in the bottles and we've been putting them into the duck pool um, to keep the water cold. So that way we don't have to just keep running water. So we've been freezing the bottles and then when the, when the water starts to heat up or feel like it's getting a little warmer, we've been throwing them in the water and that's been keeping the water cold. And so of course, as they thaw throughout the day, we take them out, we put new ones in that keeps the water cold. So yeah, that's kind of how that's worked out for us. But yeah, we got a new duck, um, uh, pool with a tub it's a pretty big tub um all the ducks have been able to get in there um we're looking at getting two more i think they call them akana ducks um i was going to get them today but i didn't get them today because we got new chickens today so i'm going to show you guys the new chickens and that may be a side video so i can tell you guys what kind they are how we're brooding them and what we're going to go from there okay all right talk to you guys in a little bit peace 